Here I have Huawei Mate 8 and let me show you how to bypass Google verification on the following phone. So saying in, in other words how to remove factory reset protection. As you can see here I have my device after a hard reset and now I have to input my email and password to my Google account and let me show you how to bypass this step. So at the very beginning you have to active your keyboard and then let's tap this button right here. Let's hold down for a little bit longer and choose more languages. Excellent. From the Huawei swipe menu you have to choose download languages, that option. And as you can see the terms of swipe services just pops up, so that's what we need. Let's highlight the random word right here, choose more button and tap web search. Excellent. Now you have to use your searcher and type in test DPC. Let me correct this one, test DBC and tap search. Excellent. Let's choose the first link right here. Tap accept and continue. Choose no, thank you. Then let's scroll down and here you should find download AP key button right here. Let's tap it. As you can see your download is starting, tap allow. You can close the Chrome update if something like that pops up, but type OK to the following information. The app is downloading, so that's what we need right now. Now we have to go back, let's go back. and. Here in that searcher you have to type in settings, uh, sorry, downloads. As you can see the downloads app just pops up, so let's choose it. And here we can find our app that we previously downloaded. So let's tap this app, install is blocked. So let's go to settings and here we should enable unknown sources right here. You can read the attention and tap OK. Let's go back and let's tap our app one more time. Choose install, tap accept. Test DBC is installing, app installed, let's open. Now it's important to choose setup device owner, the second option, and choose setup. Tap setup one more time, read the information if you wish and tap OK. The app is setting the device owner. Excellent. Let's tap our app one more time. Choose install again. Tap open one more time. And now the policy management just pops up. So that's what we need. Let's scroll down to the bottom of the list. And here you should find wipe data. Let's choose it. And of course, from the following menu, we have to click on also wipe factory reset protection right here. So make sure that you have enable wiping factory reset protection and then tab OK to confirm it. Now the device is performing factory reset operation but it also did its factory reset protection so that's what what we need. The whole operation should take a while so be patient and wait until it's completely finished. Excellent, as you can see the welcome panel just pops up, so let's go through the initializing setup, let's go next, choose region and tap next. Now let me skip adding any Wi-Fi, so let me just tap skip and continue without any SIM card, tap agree to all terms and conditions, let me allow enhance internet experience, let me skip 
keep adding fingerprint and as you can see configuration is successful. Tap begin, enable Huawei Home and as you can see now we can use our device. Let me just go to settings and check if we have any Google account added. We don't have any. So everything went well, we just removed factory reset protection. Thank you for watching, please subscribe our channel and leave thumbs up under the device, under the video.